What's up guys, my name is Ace, and today I've got a relatively quick video for you guys just talking a little bit about the next set of guns that we're going to be seeing in Black Ops 4. Keeping in mind, there is nothing confirmed at this point, but up until now, we actually know about two guns that are in the game code and will be coming to the game at some point. We don't have a confirmed date on this, but the first one is the Vendetta Sniper Rifle, which is actually a Mini-14, and this has been in the game code for a very long time, and it was teased even in the Grand Heist trailer like two months ago now. Most of us expected this to be in the game a very long time ago, so it's there, it's waiting to be released, and I am quite confident that will come with the next set of weapons that we get, although who knows? I honestly thought it was going to be coming during the Grand Heist event, since it was in the trailer several times. And then at the very least, I thought if it's not coming during Grand Heist, it'll be the weapon or one of the weapons that would come at the start of the current event, which is Operation Spectre Rising, and we still haven't seen it in game. So that's the first one we know about, but another one that actually showed up in the COD Companion app, I think this was a mistake somewhere, or maybe a subtle way for them to tease this. A new tactical rifle was kind of revealed here, and this is called the S6 Stingray. Now with this one, we don't really have any information aside from the name, but it is in the COD Companion app, or at least it was, I'm not too sure if they removed it since then. But as of right now, those are two weapons that we know about that will be coming at some point to Black Ops 4 multiplayer. Now this really isn't big news, this is stuff that we've known about for a little while, you may not have caught the Companion app thing with the S6 Stingray, I didn't feel that was worth making a video about just for that one little thing. But yesterday, Treyarch Studios actually replied to a guy on Twitter. He said, what about the new sniper rifle? And their response was, more new weapons are planned for this operation, and not just the ones you think you know. So this seems to imply that we're going to be getting more weapons on top of the Vendetta as well as the S6 Stingray, because Treyarch is fully aware that we know about the new sniper rifle, the Vendetta, as mentioned in the tweet. But they also used the plural term there, they said ones, not one, and therefore that's most likely referring to the S6 Stingray as well. So it does seem we're going to be getting more than just two weapons, although at the same time I'm definitely not going to get my hopes up too much. And part of that is just due to the history of Treyarch so far with Black Ops 4, it has been quite a big disappointment when it comes to content releases, and therefore they've kind of trained me to not get my hopes up when it comes to content. But another part of that is they did use the word weapons, not guns, and this leads me to believe that it's most likely just going to be melee weapons. Maybe they'll surprise us with another gun, maybe even two guns, I think that would be great if they did something like that. But my interpretation of this is more than likely it's probably just referring to melee weapons. That's what I'm going to assume so far, not getting my hopes up on this, but who knows, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. We are still like 20 days or so away from the next part of the contraband stream for this event because it looks like they're splitting up the event into two different contraband streams which is why we only got up to tier 50. So I wouldn't expect to see any of these new weapons until we get that new contraband stream but again who knows Treyarch has been kind of all over the place they haven't really stayed consistent with how they've been doing things it seems like they're changing things up all the time when it comes to their contraband stream and how they release things and therefore maybe we'll see some new weapons earlier once again they've set the bar super low when it comes to my expectations for this game which I think really sucks but I guess it leaves room to surprise us. But with that, that's pretty much all the information I have for you guys today. I did feel that was worth making at least a quick update video for you guys on. I'd like to know in the comment section below, what do you guys think about this? Do you think Treyarch is probably just referring to melee weapons? Or do you think maybe they're finally going to surprise us with a decent content launch and give us extra new guns on top of the two that we already know about? Just let me know those thoughts in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed the video, a like rating is always appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe for more if you haven't already. I'll talk to you guys next time.